guys, welcome back to my channel. So I just came back from Goa and it was so, so, so beautiful, you guys. You know how much I love wearing backless and slip dresses and bralettes, but I also know that not everyone can be comfortable wearing stuff like that, and it's absolutely fine. And it's just fair because you're on a vacation, you need to be comfortable and completely enjoy yourselves. Um, loose, short, long, fitted, I'll be good to go. But I do understand that not everybody um, is comfortable doing that. Everyone has a different comfort zone and I completely respect that. So this video is for all you lovely ladies who are not very comfortable wearing short clothes on vacation. Don't worry, you can still look very stylish. But, but, but before you move on, um, just so you know, I've used only six garment pieces in this video. Six garment pieces for five days of vacations, varying from tops to pants to skirts and that's it and some jewelry because I also don't want you guys to overpack because vacations are all about feeling free and you know like being yourself and not carrying like like two suitcases and yeah let's start <laughs> I went for this super pretty tropical jumpsuit, laid it on top of a bright yellow top and added some complimentary earrings that I feel went really well with the color palette of the outfit and looked very goa and breezy. Top from the first day. I knotted it up a bit and bore it with these really pretty tribal print pants and oh these earrings. How pretty are these you guys? I think this outfit was the most comfortable of all the days and can be practically pulled off by any any kind of girl. I repeated the jumpsuit and wore it with a white shirt tied on top. I also added a straw hat to the outfit that added to the vacation feels and this colourful beaded necklace. I love how French this outfit turned out to be, if you know what I mean. Okay, so it's day 4 and for this one I wore an easy breezy ikka print kurta and led it with a yellow jacket which by the way is a shirt dress and to finish it off I wore these statement tassel earrings and my favourite Oxford shoes. That's it. For day 5, I paired the kurta from the last day and the pants that I wore on day 2, yes, day 2 and wore them together. I think the combination looked really cool, the whole print on print and I added um, a silver neck piece and a tassel neck piece to the entire outfit for more edge and I think it's really comfortable, perfect for a shopping day out when you're out on a vacation. It's the last day so I wanted to keep it very easy and comfy so I just wore the shirt dress as it is, added some earrings with a top knot and I was good to go. <laughs> beautiful oh my god it's so green i actually don't understand why people go to goa to party it's like such a serene place you should just sit down and you know like read books that's it so uh anyway um also a big shout out to jules for shooting this video jules you've been amazing uh in the heat of goa thank you so much for doing this and 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 a big shout out to mansi from the hair stain artist for doing my makeup and hair and also a big shout out to rahul behind the camera right now for doing this for me on such a short notice uh thank you everyone and um thank you guys if you've hung out till the end don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel come on guys let's just make it a full axe <laughs> and yeah be back super soon um